As we know that for the upward flight of the particle, its speed decreases because of the acceleration due to gravity. So we can intuitively say that the average speed for the lowest window will be highest, followed by the middle window and will be least for the topmost window. Now, as the height of each window is the same, so the time taken to cross them will be inversely proportional to the average speed of the particle while crossing them. So time taken will be maximum to cross the topmost window followed by the middle window and will be least for the bottommost window. As acceleration due to gravity is assumed to be the same, so acceleration will be the same while crossing all the windows. Also, as the acceleration is equal to the change in velocity divided by the time interval and as acceleration is the same for all the three windows, this implies that the change in velocity will be proportional to the time taken. That is, it will be the greatest for the topmost window and least for the bottommost window.